Top 10 Volcanic Islands Inside Lakes Number 1. Krenitsin Peak of Dao Ru Sir Caldera Located in the volcanic island of Onikotan, Dao Ru Sir is a caldera formed approximately 7,500 years ago after a massive eruption. One of the largest known in Russia's Kuril Islands. Krenitsin Peak is the volcano island situated in the northwest part of the lake, formed during a powerful explosive eruption in 1952. Two, Makoya Island of Rotorua Lake. Rotorua Caldera as a result of a massive eruption that took place more than 200,000 years ago. After the collapse, the caldera was eventually filled with a lake of the same name. Makoya is the name of the volcanic island situated near the center of the lake, it is a rhyolite lava dome formed after a major eruption that occurred thousands of years ago. Three, Nakajima Islands of Lake Toya Toya Caldera is a 110,000-year-old lake-filled caldera situated in Hokkaido, Japan. It was formed after the emptying of Mount Osu's magma chamber, creating a depression that eventually filled with water. 50,000 years later, an eruption occurred within this caldera lake, forming several islands. These islands are collectively called Nakajima, all of which are andesitic lava domes. Ometepe, Lake Nicaragua Lake Nicaragua is the only one in this list that does not occupy a caldera. However, it is believed that this lake was formed as a result of a powerful volcanic eruption. From being part of the ocean's bay, it became an inland basin containing the two lakes, the other one is the Lake Managua. There are about 400 volcanic islands in Lake Nicaragua, two of which form the stunning island of Ometepe. These are the Concepcion Volcano and Madera Volcano. Fifth on our list is the main tall volcano island of Tall Lake. Lake Tall in the Philippines lies in an ancient caldera, formed by a series of explosive volcanic eruptions that occurred thousands of years ago. Within the lake lies the iconic main tall volcano island, a highly active volcano that also contains a lake that evaporates during explosive eruptions, and an island called Vulcan Point. Vulcan Point has the distinction of being among the world's largest islands in a lake on an island in a lake on an island. Number 6, Motuiko Island, Lake Topa Caldera Lake Topa lies in the caldera of Topa Volcano, a supervolcano in the North Island of New Zealand. The huge caldera was created mainly by a supervolcanic eruption that occurred approximately 25,600 years ago. Motuiko is the island within the lake, it is a rhyolite lava dome formed thousands of years ago, when eruptive activities were still present around Topa Volcano. 7. Uruvi and Teodoro Wolf, Quicocha Caldera The scenic lake-filled Quicocha Caldera is located at the southern foot of the sharp-peaked Cotacachi Strato Volcano. The 3-kilometer-wide caldera was created during a major explosive eruption about 3,100 years ago. Decidic lava domes form two forested islands in the caldera lake, Yerovi, the smaller islet and Teodoro Wolf, the bigger one on our list, is Wizard Island of Mount Mazama Crater Lake. Situated in the state of Oregon, Mount Mazama's caldera was formed as a succession of overlapping cones and shield volcanoes during a stage of relatively continuous volcanic activity that lasted nearly half a million years. After its collapse, Crater Lake eventually filled the caldera. Within Crater Lake is a lone island called Wizard Island, an island which was formed hundreds of years later after the formation of the caldera. Nine, Samasir Island, Lake Toba. Indonesia's Lake Toba caldera was a result of a supervolcanic eruption that occurred about 74,000 years ago. At the heart of this lake is the Samasir Island, a volcanic lava dome formed after Toba's powerful eruption. Samasir is said to be the largest island within an island on Earth. Ten, Nakajima Island, Lake Kusharo caldera. 
Lake Kusharu Caldera was formed during a series of major explosive eruptions between 340,000 and 30,000 years ago. It is the largest caldera lake in Japan in terms of surface area and the sixth largest lake in the country. Lake Kusharu is also the largest lake in Japan to freeze over completely during winter. Nakajima is the name of the forested island that occupies the central portion of the lake. It is Japan's largest recursive island, or an island in a lake on an island. It's a lava dome, formed 10,000 years ago after a series of volcanic activities. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video.